this is Raquel or Rockin' Curls and I am here to talk to you today and give you a little review of this Groom Industries Solvent Free Sprayer. Um, I got it on Amazon. I love it because it's more of a fine mister than a regular spray bottle from Walmart or Sally's. And um, I'll show you a demo of how it works and how it sprays. But um, normally when I try to spray my hair with these kind of spray bottles, I just have a really high frizz factor and when I spray my hair with conditioner water, it will just frizz and go crazy. Now, um, I usually my second day hair is fine and I, I can just spray some kind of curl refreshing spray on my hair and I'm good to go. But by day three and four, my waves are looking pretty flat and just dry. So this gets moisture back in and helps the curls start to come back and gives me a little more volume. Um, but I'll show you, the reason why I like this one better, it's such a fine mist that when it sprays on my hair, it doesn't agitate it as bad. It just gently mists and I feel like the cuticle doesn't get agitated as much so it doesn't frizz as much. Whereas this one, it's such a thick stream compared to it. It just kind of just disrupts the curl and just my hair goes wonky and I don't like it. So I actually have better luck just putting water on my hands and smoothing and then putting gel or conditioner on top than using this. That's why I never sprayed my hair before. So then when I found this, I was really excited and I'll give you a demo now of how it sprays. So uh, I usually do conditioner and water and a third of the water volume will be conditioner and I'll use Kinky Curly Knot today, usually, or something like a more natural conditioner. And then I'll just mix it up and then I'll spray it. And so this one, sprays finer and longer than a regular spray bottle. So I'll show you now. So, wait. So you can see it sprays longer and it sprays really fine. See? Now it's a little clumpy because it's been sitting a while, but when I make it fresh, your refreshing mixture should just look like um, skim milk. But it's really cold in my house right now. So it's kind of settled out, but, um, so that's how it looks on my hand. Um, and I'll, I'm going to wipe it up and, and show you just what one spray looks like. Wait. So that's one spray. So sometimes what I'll do is I'll spray it on my hand and I'll just scrunch it into my hair. But usually what I do is I just flip over like this and I just, Spray like that, maybe twice, and it it's just it's just easy to use, and and just do like um, maybe three or four sprays, you know, if it's really fat, flat, maybe five or six, and then um, I'll take some kind of natural light hole gel or curl enhancer and I noticed that gels with film forming humectants in it like flaxseed gel or something those work really well they're not as sticky and they're light and so I'll just um, a little bit of this gel and I'll just you know smash it in or just put this straight in and you, sometimes if your hair is really frizzy you could put the gel on first spray and then put more gel. And actually what I did today is I just sprayed my hair with the bottle. Then I put this gel in and then I did the Q Redo for, and I steamed a couple minutes with it. And then I put more of this um, Uncle Funky Curl Stimulator on and I have to put this on afterwards because like I said I have a high frizz factor so then I get a frizz halo and um, I just did this 
and I let it air dry and I had a really good hair day for me for fourth day hair. My hair doesn't usually look good and I have to rewash or just put it in a bun. So this is pretty, pretty good for me and I was happy with my fourth day hair with these results. And um, yeah, I just encourage you to check this out. I'll put it in the link and just play with different different ways of refreshing your hair. You know, try different gels, different levels of hold on the gels. Maybe you need a hard hold gel, maybe you just need a medium. Some people put um, oil or some people like a couple drops of oil in here. If your hair is high porosity, you could try that. Or if you need more moisture. And then uh, you can also put a little styler in here and mix it up. Um, I have just like doing this kinky curly in here with the water and it's light. And my virgin hair is actually low porosity now from about here to here. So it's really liking this kinky curly leave-in as opposed to before it didn't really help me at all um, but yeah that's what I've been using and I've had much better luck with third and fourth day hair than I used to and um, on second day hair I'll just do a curl refreshing spray and I'm usually good to go unless I had a crazy second day hair then I would use this but um, yeah just go ahead and try it and Hope you like it, and I hope you're having fun with the curling method. Talk to you later. Bye.